Here we go. Welcome to Vote TV Primetime Show. I'm your host, Nelson Mike Medal Murioki, and this is the Rauka na Vote TV Breakfast Show. Kariboni, 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 whatever you are, whatever you're watching from. And uh, as usual, this broadcast is live streaming on other platforms concurrently, which includes the Vote TV YouTube channel the Nelson Mike Podcast YouTube channel, and also on Twitter at Vote Television. It's a beautiful Sunday morning. It's midnight in the USA. And today I have another special story. As I wait for you guys to tune in, the main topic today, we are going to look at the story of another Kenyan that unfortunately we have lost. This time in Lebanon. And I will be joined by the family members today who will give us more information about this case. Before I actually even introduce the first family member, let me welcome Anam So, watching all the way from Dubai. Everyone who is coming here, introduce yourself. Let me know where you're watching from as we proceed again. The Rauka. Nabo TV Breakfast Show. TV Breakfast Show. Mike Medamo. Mike Medamo. Yagi. In the non, the Ragini Alduraso. I also already got an angel. Dominic. 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 Yes, sir. Dominic. Yes, sir. Oh, okay. Oh. You are talking. You you just talking. give me a second. Okay. Let's focus. We are live. It's okay. I'm sorry. Okay. I can welcome also, let me welcome Alan Osemo, saying Osemo. praise to God. Okay, there's an echo on your end, Dominic. I don't know where that is coming from. Are you guys watching on... Uh, are you watching the show somewhere else? No, no, I'm just live in the office. I don't have any other okay. media on. There's still still echo or okay. just mute? Okay. Can I mute? Okay, let me see. Well, it's going to work. Let me, let's try. Let me, let me first of all welcome Alan Osemo in Kenya. I have Shiro watching all the way from the UK. So, Dominic, I'm trying to... Okay. Uh, yeah, there's an echo coming from your end and it's pretty disturbing. Let me remove you and then you come back again, okay? There's an echo coming from my end? Yeah, it's coming from your end, yeah. Let me mute. Let me mute. Uh, uh, I Gilbert mute? is coming in. I'm trying to enter, but the network is not all that good. It's the one who gave me a call. But uh, let me just mute, then I can follow. When you just want me to talk, okay. I can unmute. Okay. 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 Let me first of all get rid of. Let me try something here. Sorry, guys. We, we'll make it work. Don't worry. Alan, step by step. Okay. I think the echo is coming from Gilbert. Gilbert. Hello. Yeah. Hi, Gilbert. Abadi Asubui. Hi. I can hear Okay, we are trying to uh, to get this thing with your <laughs> connection fixed, but it's no problem. It's going to work. Okay, Karibu, Karibu. Asante. Okay, kuna eko inakuja kutoka saidi yako? Inasagwe natoko wabi ju sinabari. Okay, so, so, uh, what you can be able to find your viewers, uh, just understand the connectivity issue. Uh, Gilbert, they can, they can understand. So, is it Nico? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uko kisi sahi? 
Umenipata? Okay, right yeah, now niko okay. Yamira County. Maana nafanya uh-huh. kazi nyumbani au kisi. Niko nyumbani. Oh, okay. Niko Yamira County sasa hivi. Okay. Um yes. Ambia watazamaji Edna Kemunto ni nani nani kwako. Okay, Edna Kemunto. Mhm. Nimis kwangu mtoto wa sister yangu. She's my niece, mtoto wa sister yangu. Okay, okay. Na tafadhali elezea watazamaji yale ambayo imefanyi, yale ambayo imetendeka. Okay, yule mtoto Mhm. Alikuja akaolewa sometimes back, aka after ameolewa akatoka nyumbani Lebanon. Wakiwa mm-hmm. mene huko Lebanon, atuko mm-hmm. na baada at the moment. Amekaa mm-hmm. Lebanon for some time bila sisi kuwa yote. Sasa ikafika mm-hmm. ikafika mahali tukapata video ati ameumia Lebanon. Mhm. Hiyo video ndio tukaanza kuuliza kwa nini Lebanon ameenda muda gani hiyo? Mhm. Tukasema juu ameumia sasa si tunasabika simu tu video call. Na uko mm-hmm. Lebanon tuweze kuona status yake. Yeah. Afta kuomba video call nao the agency wa Lebanon. Mhm. Wakasema ame, ameenda ina in coma. Sasa yeye una hakuna vile. Tunazabia video call ya kumuona. Mhm. Sasa tukawaambia sasa mtatu update progress yake akiwa mgonjwa mgonjwa Hola mm-hmm. nimekuwa kijulishia kwa acha kwa acha kwa acha tuambiwa kwa ICU tu hapo no report ni ICU tu ikafika mahali mm-hmm. posi wake mm-hmm. akasema simu yote sipiwe na muti yote asingie room ya edi sasa ikaleta wasiwasi wow. mbona amesema simu isipiwe na muti asingie room ya edi na Mhm Zao ndio hiyo kusema hakuna Hakuna ku kwa access yeye. Mm-hmm. Ni report imetoka hapa. Report report kwa baadaye amekufa. Mhm. Sasa amekufa akiwa Lebanon hapo at under what circumstances? Tumeambiwa tu amekufa hivyo mm-hmm. na ko Lebanon. Mhm. <coughs> Sandio tulikuwa tunaomba kama au watu wale walikuwa wanafanya kazi watuambie ile kitu ilivanyika kabisa kabisa alikufa aje. Wanasema alianguka kwa Rova akaunga chini mm-hmm. akawa serious dakika tu alianguka aje na choa kuanguka ni sana labda mtu akusukuma kuanguke mhm tutangu tukae na yeye mpaka saa hizi mimi si kuona siku amekuwa na sheria ya kuanguka hapo nyumbani ndio amesoma kutoka primary secondary ama mpaka college akamaliza college akiwa nyumbani ndio akaolewa watu akiwa sawa akuwa na sheria yote ya kuonyesha ni kama anaweza anguka anytime Mhm. Sasa bado ndio wametu wametuacha kuagiza giza kubwa ati alianguka aje hiyo ndio ile swali kubwa alianguka aje alisukumwa ama alianguka aje sasa. Na amekufa. Alienda 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 Lebanon lini? Hiyo ndio ile awa pi awa awa wasti wa yani tunashangani tume, tume, nini ilivyofanyika juu mtoto wetu tumekaa naye akiwa mdogo mpaka sasa amekuwa mkubwa amekufa ghafla mhm domeni katu hapo domeni katu hapo kwa sababu ni kwenda uko na echo umenipata vizuri hebu tuambie ati ulienda ulienda mwaka gani alienda mwaka gani hiyo time ya kwenda Lebanon ndio tujui lakini ni kama one year ndio imekaa tuchaona ye. Na umesema alikuwa ameolewa. Kuolewa alienda missing. Bonake yuko wapi? Aliolewa akaka kwa kwa anaonekana kwetu. Sasa kuolewa ni kama aliolewa na kwenda Lebanon immediately. Ya kuolewa. Okay. Okay. Okay Mbani lakini Dominic kukae tu hapo. Dominic Dominic najua na, 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 nasikia lakini Dominic you are the one who's having the echo but stay there still. 
Uh, but nime mute microphone yako Dominic so we can't hear you so cha Gilbert onge uh, we'll figure this thing out technology you see the job go we're on well, the other end of the world Lebanon mm-hmm. one almost one year kwa aliolewa akaenda kwake leo ndio ametoka kwake akaenda kazi sahihi Bwana ya okay niko na maswali hapa Bwana bwanake Edna yuko wapi Okay, we'll struggle. We'll struggle. We'll make it work. We'll, it's gonna make it. We're gonna make it work. I think I'm going to work again. Kwa kazi zaini kiongea niko kwa station. Yeye kwa nyumbani mali ame then alikuwa ameolewa. Okay, give me a second, okay? So what I'm gonna try to do here is Let me cut up and you on askia, but nime mute microphone yako. Give me a second. Wacha wacha ni mute. Wacha wacha ni mute. Gilbert Gilbert kaja kidogo nita commute kidogo lakini ukae tu hapo JN watching from Saudi Arabia sasa niko tu online Okay now I'll try something kwa sababu the point is Dominic uko na quality yako ya simu ni ni mzuri kabisa lakini ukona ukona echo mob so i've actually muted your microphone so let's try this let's try let me i'm going to unmute dominic's microphone and then hopefully you won't have any echo dominic dominic yes you can hear me una nipata okay okay poa kabisa poa kabisa eh Nimetoka unajua nilikuwa kwa office I think the echo comes from the the the, the room. Kuna machine okay, so kuna machine is coming. Okay, we'll, we'll we'll struggle with it. Don't no problem because I have we have to cover this story. It's okay. Dominic, let's go back to the story. Yes. Let's go back to the story. Yeah. Sasa Where is the husband? Where is the husband? Mhm. The husband, the husband ya kwa nyumbani kwa kwake kisi. Mhm. Yeah, from him. Mhm. Actually, actually we talked to I talked to the husband yesterday and mm-hmm. we do talk. Okay. So this is an an issue where we have come together, we are sharing this problem together. Okay. Kwa ufu, and uh, when, kwa ufu, uh, when, uh, Go ahead. Uli, When did Edna leave the country to go to Lebanon? Most likely December or January because we were together November last year the return we had an anniversary that's the last time we saw Edna. So most likely she left on December or January. But the the, the husband is not ready to tell us exactly when she left because he left my as our concert uh, we came to realize that the night is not in Kenya when we tried to call him we have tried several times mm-hmm. to call our number our number was going off so we decided to just investigate doing our own investigation by july i came to realize that edna is in, in lebanon oh my god i tried uh, you can hear me Yeah, we can hear. Keep on you are very clear. Keep on talking. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. By July this year, I came to realize that Edna is in in Lebanon. I myself so I decided she, to, she. I decided to reach her, but it's as if they made an agreement with the husband to not disclose where she was. I talked to her, I just just greeted her, I asked her where she was. She said this is at home. It's quite unfortunate but they on on 26th October that's my elder sister the mother to Edna called me and just <laughs> told me that the, she has received a call from the Edna's husband uh, informing her of the 
the condition of Edna in Lebanon. Uh, it was late at night. I decided to just let it go until the morning on 27th. I decided to call the family of the husband to Edna, who actually gave me the, the full information and they sent me the, some videos, if at all. I don't know if you have the videos. I have them. Uh, uh, you have them? So yes. from that, on 27th, I, I decided to call them. I, we requested as a family to know when the dead left Kenya for Lebanon, but they were not ready to tell us. That was wow. an issue. We asked for the agent's numbers. They were not ready to give. But we decided to wow. use, uh, I decided to send the Gripat because my, other bro my younger brother and me are always residing in Nairobi. Yeah. Uh, he went to, we went with my elder brother, Nicodemus. They went to the family where Edna is married. Uh, mm. The family was not was not ready to give enough information. We decided to involve the chief, the assistant chief of the same subrogation, who persuaded mm. them to give the number. Finally, they gave us the number. The number they gave me is the number for the Kenyan representative in Lebanon. I it's take the initiative. I contacted the, the same people who are at the Lebanon. I just tried to require if they have any information regarding the case of Edna. Uh, they agreed mm -hmm. that the information, they have the information, but Edna is, in, uh, is, is hospitalized under intensive care unit. I engaged them from 27, 28, 29, 30th, and 31st. They were giving you the same information. I requested them to just, if they are the representative of Kenya in Lebanon, to just go straight to the hospital where Edna is admitted and get the right information so that they can That's give right. us the exact, set, the, the exact status of the Edna's health status. Uh, they responded by, by, by telling me that they cannot make it to the hospital, but the the hospital report will be out soon. Until the second, this month, mm. I tried to ask them, it was on Tuesday, I think it was on Wednesday, I decided to just ask them if at all there is any update regarding the, the condition of the patient. They told me by today or tomorrow you will get the medical report. I told them why medical report and the medical report is given when a patient is discharged or when anything has been done. So I don't expect the medical status, but I need you to go there physically that you can visit that patient and give me a video call. I can see my niece. That's right. They started, they, they started asking me several questions. They asked me whether we, we do communicate with Edna uh, openly. When did we communicate last? because it now was admitted at the same hospital on 1st September. And, he passed right. on, right. and she passed on on the 25th October. We were not aware. I told them I don't have much information about the Edna. What you can do just to talk, talk to the husband to Edna is at the position yeah. of giving you the information. Because they were asking me whether Edna was sending some money. Me, I told them I don't know because Edna was married. Mine is just to know the the, the, the status. But asking a several questions whether the, the, the boss was paying, what type of shop. Because in the first place, the family, we were not aware when the, she left for Lebanon. So I decided, to, I decided to give them the number of the husband. When I gave the husband, they, they told me, can you kindly tell the husband the online? I in turn went here, I called the husband, I told him the people from Lebanon, they want to talk to you. Can you just switch on your phone and be online? After some time, like 30, 40 minutes, uh, the husband was given a, a breaking news that the Edina died on 25th, and this was on 2nd. The husband called me, 
because he, told, he usually called me and go. Then we have sad news. So Edna didn't make it from ICU. She passed on on 25th October. I asked, I, I asked him why then they, they were keeping out this long. If somebody died on 25th, why did they, they decide to keep the, the same news until 2nd? I told him to give me the number that he was called by. I took the number, I called back, and I found the person who was the, holding the same phone is from the Minister of Foreign Affairs by the name Alan mm -hmm. Mbulu. Mm -hmm. I tried to inquire more about the case. He confirmed to me that they did not burst on on, on 25th October while undergoing treatment. I tried to ask him what was the cause of death. He told me the he, he just responded. So we have the medical report, and the medic from the medical report it shows that they did not die of cardiac arrest. I asked the the, the, the same person cardiac arrest and at the age of 22. Uh, he responded that the, the, there is more information about it, the same. The the cardiac arrest was from the result of falling from high place. That's right. Which, That's right. Which made yeah. the some organs of Edna to do the capture. Uh, That's so right. The medical That's right. Uh, from the medical reports, uh, she had a, a rupture in the spleen, liver, and the intestine. At the same time, he had some fractures. He has a scar fracture, and the, some bones. So I asked him, "How? What happened?" He told me that he uh, did not fall from third floor and we are waiting for the police report so that they can just uh, uh, conclude. So current time, I'm just waiting for the police report of which I asked yesterday, it was on, on, on Friday. I communicated wow. with the same people. They told me the, the police report is out, but it's written in Arabic language. I have to wait until the translator comes to translate the same report so that you can get the same report in English. As of that's now, right. that's, that's what I can say about the story of Edna, which leaves the family with a lot of question marks. The first question mark, you can see from your face, if you can see the picture uh, of Edna, she has like a pan. Which, made, which, is, which is questionable. What transpired the pants on the face? They can say mm. she had some fractures in the hands. I don't understand mm. if somebody can just fall down. If at all, mm. we can we, let us assume that the Ariangukia Kichwa, Ange Fungika Mikono, na Kichwa, na the organs singe were affected so that at the same time. Ukiangalia mikono mm. anaweza chukua mkono mwenye imefunjika iwezi kucha ichikune kwa uso. Those are several questions the family is, is, is asking without, without answers. For now, that's mm. what I can say, and I'm very grateful for this show. Gilbert. Gilbert. Uh, I'll mute Dominic. It's and, okay. Uh, but stay there, Dominic. But stay there, Dominic. And then, it's okay. I have no problem. Then, 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 then. I mean. Gilbert. Yes. Ni hapi ngetaka kuongezea ambayo brother ako ametuambia. But they are going to come on your guest or your again. Is I you must worry, Melissa? You take a bend at one beware. Not you can walk to Gorova. Gorova will be missing of Congo to Gorova's lazy. Not unless Mutam Kuskuma. A point, I love who you use of a young one bills again in a candidate to my choma. It is good at Choma and Nini. She was young over Rova who say it's Jamaica yard. At Unga Gini, who say Jamaica Gini, one at Unga Guamoto. Let me call on Zame Fujika, Gangalia and Kama. You mutoto by them and I got admitted to study. 
ni kama alikuwa amepitia mateso mikono hiyo ukiona mikono ni kama ilikuwa imeanza kupona akiwa hospitali tu mimi nilitezwa labda akapelekwa hospitali aende kukupia huko na safari mimi sasa hiyo kitu natumwa juu mtoto amepitia shida akiwa mdogo mpaka sasa hivi kusoma ilikuwa ni ngumu amaliza shule alafu aende kutezwa na kuuliwa ghafla tu hiyo I, I let I, I, it doesn't make sense by the hiyo medical report yao iko na questions mark question marks mingi sana unaisoma lakini kuelewa ina ni kama mtu aliambiwa yeye andika hivi tu sio ni medical report hiyo ni opinion expert haitakuwa na question marks ya kuulizwa lakini vile tunaiona ni kama wanatupepa tu kutupepa uvara mahali juu umu sana bila mikuwa mpaka sasa hii hatukuona akiona shida na mali amesomea amesoma shule zingine alikuwa anasoma kwa ghorofa mbona hapo huko kwa shule kwa ghorofa kwa shule ande kwa unga lepa noni huko kwa tambio tu kweli tulifanya 1 2 3 ndio hivi na hivi na mtoto amekufa lakini kutoweka kwa hiyo kwa hiyo kita all along mpaka sasa hivi na vile umezikia domini akisema alikuwa admitted yeah alikuwa admitted hospitali hapo ni kama alidimitiwa ali, ali mapema wakanyamaza mpaka ikaonekana hii kitu hata shida ndio wakasema ako hospitali yeah. kwa uliza sitreza make hiyo video call ikasemekana kwa ICU yani ukiuliza swali unapelekwa kwa nyingine story nyingine ambayo itakuwa ni ngumu zaidi watambie tu kweli ile kitu ilifanyika from the start mpaka sasa hivi na watu usaidie hii mtoto wetu atoke ngambo akuje Kenya tumuone macho yetu tu akisha amekufa tumuzike tu story zingine tunajia Mungu tu Mungu ndiye anajua ile kitu ilifanyika na Europe Europe time mtoto amekufa kwa kingine ya uchungu na kutuajia shida sisi wenye tuko hai sasa mtoto mwenye kuna 20 years mtoto mdogo sana ange mmoja tu amrudisha Kenya afanye kazi zake tu ameacha mtoto juma ambaye ni mtoto wa 2 years ndio atakuwa mkubwa bila kuona mamake na hata historia yake hata hata ielewa hiyo tu watairia tu mtoto wetu atakaye hapo akuje tumzike alafu tumwachia Mungu Mungu aisi aje mtoto wetu hiyo roho yake iende hivyo hivyo chuo ameua hiyo ni kama ni kuwa mtoto from the suffering she underwent ni kama kuna kitu walikuwa wanataka kwa chief na hizo cases ni mingi huko watu wanakufa huko wanaulizwa huko si mbona watsaidie tu mtoto yetu kuja Kenya na tusikie tu tusawe story yake lakini wajue tu tumejea Mungu Mungu ndio ata revenge on on happy hour ni hayo tu brother na nimekuja kwa the show Um Gilbert Capo Sawa so, sawa so. Dominic Capo Uh let me play the video oh, And by the way the viewers are saying the same thing the viewers are saying the left eye that it it doesn't show like ni kama alikuwa kuna kitu alikuwa amefanywa Um let me let's see the video when she was at the hospital kwa kidogo <clears throat> to the viewers i'll play the video okay they love you too okay my dear god bless you What? Water, yeah. Okay, I will give you water. Give me water. Give me water. Uh, let me play this video again. And you have my gift for you. This is Jesus who protected you because you are a good person. Okay? Say hi to your family in Kenya. Tell them that you are coming. Hi. Hi. Okay. They love you too. Okay, my dear. God bless you. 
Give me water. What? Give me water. Water, yeah. Okay, I will give you water. Sorry, man. Sorry. Gilbert, uh, <laughs> Dominic, Dominic, yes, yes. Oh, sorry, man. Oh, sorry. Uh, no problem. We are okay. <laughs> so, actually, I have one question. One more question. <laughs> We try to ask for the, the number of the, the, the boss of Edna, but the, the husband were not ready to give up to now. So that one also gives a lot of suspicion because we wanted to have the same number. We are the same family. We are a family from Edna, and the family for to where is, is his marriage, they have the contacts of the all both agents and the, 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 the boss. So we were given, we were not given any access. Now the question goes, why is the number is, 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 is not given? Because they do communicate to the husband, but we don't communicate to the boss. <laughs> um, let me admit, uh, and I'm gonna say this to the viewers. I'm gonna say this to the viewers. The uh, the toughest thing for me is watching two men on my on my show cry on my show cry. It's tough. It's tough. It's tough. It's tough. It's tough. It's tough. We are losing a generation, Dominic. Losing a generation, Dominic. Yeah, we have because we have taken that kid was actually the stall of that kid. If we can give it all on air, everybody can fly, but we cannot give. We cannot give. Oh. Oh. She uh, Dominic, you work at the embassy. I'm a security officer. I work with KK and I man one of the officers in the embassy. Yeah, I'm a security officer. Tell us, um, tell us something about about Edna. About Edna. Yeah. There's something you you said. There's something you wanted to tell about as about her life. Her life. You know, you know, Edna. We were with her the last time. We were with her. It was uh, the anniversary of my dad. It was on 50 November 2021. We were together with Edna and the family. If I told you, we were together, the pictures of the same. Edna told the people she is going, but she would give, come and give us a surprise. And mm. fortunately, the surprise that she has given us is coming in a coffin from Lebanon where we were not ready and we were not aware of our going there. Mm. 
Yani, I don't, I, I don't imagine. I cannot imagine because we have spent a lot of money educating Edina from from baby class all along to the college. She just graduated on 2020 with a diploma in banking and accounting. She has not even waited for her to get a, a better job. But they went, they decided with the husband and the mother-in-law to just take her to Lebanon so that they can get rich very, very fast. Unfortunately, without telling you, she has without come telling you. dead. Yeah. We, telling you. we were not, actually, Edina is like my firstborn daughter. Edina oh my is like my firstborn daughter. I live in a, in a, in a, in a Gorova, 60th floor. We were staying with the number one aqua yanguka. Ananga historia ata ya ugonjwa yoyoti ya kuanguka tuseme ama alikuwa na ugonjwa akaanguka kutoka Gorova. Ni naka 64 in Nairobi apartment. Na tumekana ye ya I stay I have stayed with her for so long. And enough stayed with Edna for the last 20 years. You need that 20, I'm gonna 22 years for the last 20 years to Megana. 20 years to Megana. So I'm a whatever for two years. In the Osasa and Aguja could develop a complication and a Sanguka could talk about Rova. And from the husband, while you're on Gana, while you're on Gana on the first September, the husband is confirming that while you're on Gana. Aka wakaongea kwa simu, aka muambia wacha, wacha niende nifanya kasi, eh, madam bosi akikucha asipate sitapanya kasi. So, from that statement, meaning, wakati madam bosi alipokucha, aka pata ui mutu wajafanya te kasi, then the problem started there. And that's when the our phone went off from, from the, the, the husband to see testimony. Waliongea na ye mbaka around saa tano na. Haka mwambia wacha nienda nifanya kazi kidogo. Ndiyo mkupu mdo posi ya kikucha asikuche kukombana. Meaning alikuwa na kukombana. Eh? But now the, 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 from the, the medical report we are, we are expecting the police report. You cannot know what, what, is, what in, the, the, the police report entails. But these are the several questions to Nauriza. Kutoka yo saa tano nda akanguka. Na hiyo komba ni kama hiku kwa na mtu. Nani alikuja kumuokota, haka mpereka hospitali. And I understand, alitipiwa, ali akapona, akarudi nyumbani. Aliporudi nyumbani, ndi haka kuwa dehydrated, then haka rudisho hospitali, ndi haka perekuwa koma, ndi haka kufa. That's the history. From that report, wanasema walitoa the spring. Ni nini ilifanya atorewe spring? Na why did they conduct the postmortem minus family members being there? If somebody has passed on, there is no need for them to just lash. She passed on on 25th, postmortem is done on 26th. We, are, we were informed on the 2nd. Why? All these things were done in hurry. Because kama mutu amekufa, amekufa. Wangengoja family ambigo mutu amekufa, next of kin, akuje, wa conduct the postmortem before the, even the, the representative from the family. So that you can believe whatever the, the, the report is. Sisi wajinga, tukwangi wajinga, ni vile sasa tuna anything tunesafanya. We cannot do anything asha kufa. We, we, we just request for them to just bring us our, our daughter back to Mushike, to Sao, Mungu wa Dariba. Um, Dominic, um, um, Dominic, um, Edna alikuwa kama mtoto, alikuwa mtoto, alikuwa mtoto wako. Wende wende memulea. Alikuwa mtoto, alikuwa mtoto. Um, did she lose? Did she lose her parents? Did she lose her parents? Yeah, Najua. She has. She has the parents. Oh, she has the parents. She has the parents. What are the parents? What are the parents saying? Actually, my sister is even not talking. My mom, the grandmother, the Edina, went to. She was unconscious for for the last two days. Kwa sababu edina mama yake na family hawakuwa stable. Mimi my do work, hiyo kazi nafanya kidogo. Gripa jamikuja kwa kuachiliwa kama nishamrea. So edina tumekuwa tumeshikana na na, na gripa tukimsomesha na my other brother. 
lakini entirely alikuwa anakaa kwa mkono wangu because I got, uh, a lot of stories a lot of funny stories you can talk behind the scene the, the, the end the video uh, one, one thing you've said is uh, uh, one, one thing you've said is uh, she was 22 years old she was 22 years old Yeah, from the from two years old until twenty, to make an age. When you go to college, you can find a job. I can. I can. Eh? Um, I find a banking and accounting. Yeah, I'm finding a diploma in bank. I got a diploma. I graduate with a diploma in banking and accounting. from Kisi University. This hurt. She just graduated on 20th. Huh? I wasn't ready for this. Wow. Wow. Kisi University. Kisi University. Yes. Diploma. Diploma. In banking and accounting. in banking and accounting and then she decided to go and to be a house a house help in Lebanon it doesn't make no damn sense ata kutafuta kazi akukuja hata Nairobi aniambie can you just look for me have a job because amebata bwana najua love love ina kisa zingine mapensi wanasemanga love is prime So whatever they were discussing with the husband out of love she decided to make a, a conclusion to go to Lebanon and these stories are every day aired for television right. everywhere that's, right. that's right that's right and they know i was to object how going that's why yes. they decided to yes. do it kuifanya without your consent walichua to singe kubali singe kubali as a family we are we are actually we, we, our hearts are bleeding if you see me crying <laughs> it's only i don't i don't know what to do but i have to control my temper yes let me let me say something it's that's what that was the most um, and again that was the most um, again having two men having two men cr- crying at crying at the same time on my show is that 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 has never happened and it's the toughest thing i'm i'm still trying to recover and i can feel your pain and i can feel your pain um dominic momani esiba yes momani esiba i see you i have my i have my friend momani um he's a freelance journalist by the way and he's from kisi by the way and he's from kisi um um we'll touch base after this we'll touch base after this it's okay I have my friend here Bashir Bashir is an agent Bashir is an agent um Lebanon 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 you only make 15000 shillings 15000 shillings the most you can make in Lebanon is only 20 20000 shillings she had a diploma in banking and accounting and she chose chose to go to Lebanon go to Lebanon it's painful painful dominic dominic yes this is the second this case i'm having here i'm having here another another 22 year old who went to Saudi Arabia against the will of her husband of her husband she is coming back in a casket same story story like story edna one yet lambiwa lanuka akitoka kutoka kwa gorofa somewhere on the second third floor they say from third floor with your seat, with uh, your niece they're saying it's the third floor 
Mesh, Mesh, I want you to come here. I have another sister. Ambaye, ambafanya kaji sana. Lebanon. Mesh. Mesh. Your information, you are because I know you are coming right now. This is the uncle. This is the uncle. And both uncles were here. And we've, they've given us all the information. So we know every bit. Na masama kwa na mtoto? Masama kwa na mtoto. Ha, kwa na mtoto. Na kami ngapi? Na kami ngapi? Two years. The other lady ambao nakwambia Njeri Njeri Ameacha Ameacha three kids to two third okay Dominic the sorry um tujikaze tuko hapa tutajikaza yeah I, 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 I want to play this video again. There's something I want to look at. Uh, there are two videos. Do you have all the, the, both videos? I only have one. That's the only video that I have. Kuna video ya nyanaisha. Naesa ituma aje. Okay. Ntumia kwa WhatsApp? Ntumia kwa WhatsApp. Kwa WhatsApp. Do you have... Uh, Nikupati number. number. Nikupati number. The yes, number is... Do you see the number on the screen? We'll play that video. We'll play that video. Class one. Class one. One minute. This is such a painful story. Mesh. Class one. Mesh. Oh, give me a second. Oh, give me a second. Uh, we're gonna do this as we are, as we are running this broadcast. Go ahead, brother. Mesh Angalia. Mesh Angalia. Five seven one. Five seven one. Five seven one. Three six one. Three six one. Three six one three one zero four three one zero four. Let me just That's save right. and then uh, That's right. Yeah. You can send me the video because I can actually because I can even play the video. I even play the video. I don't know as I don't know as a Can you send yeah. can you send the video while we are still, we are still here? talking here? Can I send it through the, 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 the ring? No, no, just send it through the, just send it by WhatsApp. I'll play the video right here. I'll play the video right here. Yeah, it's right now. Um, let me save the number, then I just send it right send now. Send it to me. Just give me, give okay. me like, a, okay. it, it has an, it less than a minute. Okay, less and then I'll bring it back. Sure. Gilbert is not there? No, I'll bring Gilbert. No, I'll, bring Gilbert. I'll, I'll bring him back. I'll bring him back. It's okay. Um, Mesh, I'm going to check the comments, yeah, Mesh. Bashir, Bashir, your comment, Ingena your link. I want you guys to come here. We have to, we have to discuss this story. Okay. Now I've muted uh, Dominic. Uh, to all the viewers, let me bring the other uncle. Oh yeah. Hey, Leon, you are the You watch two men cry. That's the hardest thing I've ever had on this show. But to Jikaza, um, Gilbert. Gilbert. Goja. Okay. Gilbert, when you sasa? Pakuskia na kusikia. Okay, sasa pakuskia. Ah, uh, kwa hivyo tafadhali uniwie radi tafadhali. Nataka tu nataka tuangalie hii video pamoja tukiwa sisi wote. Uh, I want I, I want us to watch the video again. Sasa. So, so. Give me a second. Give me a second, okay? And you have my gift for you. This is Jesus who protected you because you are a good person. Okay? Say hi to your family in Kenya. Tell them that you are coming. Bye. Bye. 
Okay, dear. They love you too. Okay, my dear. God bless you. What? Water, yeah. Okay, I will give you water. Um, this video. Pole, 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 pole Gilbert. Pole, pole Gilbert. Uh, but this connection can attack at one earlier. See what it can come on. Um, guys, everyone who's here watching, can you please um send a message of comfort? Send a message, send a prayer. These two men are in pain. As I'm waiting for Nagoji and to me, your video. I'm waiting for the other video from the uncle. But please, uh, um, listen. This is this is this is this is this is painful. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, I've, there's something I've received here from Dominic. So. Tafadali, I want to me send a message of uh, comfort, and we'll look into we'll dive into the, we'll, dive, we'll dive into the other videos. Ambazoni Batumiwa now, my Gilbert. So here she's being. Let's let's play the first video, Dominic and uh, Gilbert and those who are here. And I'm gonna welcome some other guests. Look at the other videos too. Okay, let's. There's something I wanted to say, uh, Gilbert and Dominic. She's laughing here. She looks like she was a very, a very happy young young lady. Uh, let me unmute. I have to unmute. Uh, let me unmute Dominic, and then I'll mute. Okay, I'll mute Dominic first. I'll, have to, I'll mute Gilbert. Dominic. Dominic. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Oh, can you? Oh, can you? Oh, no, the echo now got louder. Let me, louder. let me see. Do you have another phone which is on? You have a second phone. I can hear. No, no. Hold up. Can you talk now? Can you talk now? I can talk. Okay. 
I want there's something I want I want us to look at. There's something I want us to look at. Hii picha ambayo umechoma hapa. She's she's smiling. She's smiling. Yeah, that's why from that picture ana smile. Wanasema ali alikuwa discharged. From that picture inaonyesha alipona akarudishwa akarudishwa kwa nyumba kwa nyumba mm. that's when the, mm. that's when the, the second time the second time ndio akagonjeka saidi na akagonjeka saidi na let's look at more pictures i love you tell us what oh my goodness oh my goodness Tell us what's going on here Tell in this family picture. This was the reunion. This was the reunion. Can I leave the nation again? Can I leave the nation? Yes, again? please. Okay. Yes, yes, please. Okay, exclusive pictures and okay. exclusive videos received from the family members these are the two uncles uh watch only letter gilbert mururi gilbert karibu uh tafadhali tueleze easy picture yeah this is uh this is um this is your niece in red right yes Wow, that was the reunion right right here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, Yeah, yeah. Yeah. After you, after after abu ndio alianza ku kuenda underground yaonekana sana sana. It's like ndio ilikuwa na hiyo mpango ya kumtoa Kenya aende Lebanon. Bwana yake yuko hapa kwa hii picha. Bwana yake kukuja ni yeye tu alikuja peke yake. Okay. Yes. Okay, let's look at uh... That's the other picture. Yeah, I see on the picture the record na biga nyumbani tu. Uh, asante kwa uh, thank you dominic and thank you gilbert ndio ilikuwa mara ya mwisho kumuona ya hiyo kwangu ilikuwa mara ya mwisho kabisa kumuona hata ilikuwa ya mwisho hata kuongea naye kumuona na kuongea ilikuwa hiyo ndio ya mwisho aka katika kwa hapa ni kanani aka dogo kwa hiyo brother ndomi brother ndomi ni kwa mtu watoto wake hapo i think anaweza kuwa ni ni wake ah wa ndomi ni koke ndomi ni kwa kuna watu wa ndomi okay 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 wow 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 again why he exclusive on vo tv the edna kemunto story i'm here with the family members vo tv showing the first exclusive images family pictures the uncles are here everyone who's watching here make sure that you like and you share this broadcast and if you're new on this platform make sure that you subscribe to the channel uh let me welcome my sister mesh 
Vimto, who actually has worked in Lebanon and let me bring her back here. So, uh, Gilbert, I'll mute and I'll commute like in one, like, like one, like one, like one, Gilbert, Gilbert, uh, what you know, one being me come up on a key to Huni Maliza and go when you want a monomy at Kilia, and I'm a poor panawa no me or Kilia. It's the hardest thing for me to at sitting here and watching a mother cry, I can take it like in watching a man cry. And today on this show, I've had two men at the same time cry because of the loss of their child in the so-called Middle East. Mesh. Yes. Ongea. Good morning, everyone. First, I want to send my condolences to the family of Edina Kemunto. Uh, I had the case for Edina Kemunto about her death on 25th of October. Kemunto alikuwa mekufa. But haikuwa confirmed. With it, I'm so shocked, Kuona. With it, I've just seen today that family yao isha ajua. But atujui reason, but unasema alikuwa kwa madam. Na I think that the problem with Lebanon, there is a big problem in Lebanon. Ata dawa, maybe ata kupewa dawa. Because Lebanon ata kupata dawa, unless wende dawa taki. You know? And many girls, how I understand evil. You know, we have that thing to nasema, go and risk. I think Lebanon, it is not a place to risk. A lot of problems. Shida mingi zinafanyika Lebanon. But sasa, sijui tutafanya nini. Na wasitana, wataki kuambiwa. Sijui. But tutasema, yote ni ya mungu, wachake mtu wapumzike, but you should... Kuna vitu, wait, you follow. know what, you know what, you know what? Yeah. There is one yes. thing I will not take anymore. There's one thing I will not take anymore. There's not, there's one thing, yeah. I, there was, there's one thing, there's one thing, and, and I want my fellow Kenyans to pay attention. There is one thing I will not take anymore. E statement, ya kusema ya kwamba, oh, you know what? They are being killed every day. Lakini, oh, tuachia mungu. Yes, exactly. And I'm pandan dege, go and be killed, go and be tortured, go and be done this and this. Like, and you know what? Tuachia mungu. Ata mungu wataye. There's something that God is telling us because this has become too much. Okay. Become too much. And there is one thing Kenyans don't know. Lebanese, they have killed many Ethiopians. Many Ethiopians. Ata wanajulikana by the way. Lebanese wameua Ethiopians because Kenyans hawako wanaenda Lebanon. Every day, since 2019, every week, atuko tunakosa kesi ya Ethiopians, watatu wane, wenye wameuliwa Lebanon. Na hiyo sio siri, Lebanese walikuwa na uwa Ethiopians wengi. And that's why at the moment, Ethiopians ili block Ethiopians wao kuenda Kenya. Kuenda Lebanon. But Kenyans, niju, hawako wengi, so wako napata hizo statement. We have Kenyans in Lebanon, wenye waliuliwa and they are lost. And I have one case where a girl alikufia Lebanon for the last seven years. Na alikuja last alikuja on on June. Ndi umili yake ilisafirisho. Hapa Lebanon lakini ilikuwa chini ya maji. But that moment sikuwa nongea na we Nelson sana. That girl alikufa seven years back in Lebanon. Akaletu hapa Kenya. Na akazikwa. Lakini watu hawakujua. So watu wakuwe kiafu sana na hizo Lebanon. Maybe unaishi kwa nyumba ya mtu mwenye ameua mu Ethiopia, ameua mu Kenya, na haujui. So people should be very careful. Since I don't know who lie to girls that Lebanese, they are Christian. We don't refuse they are Christian, but they are Christian on, on Sunday for two hours when they go to church. After church, they remain to be Arabs. So don't keep in mind that you are going to Lebanon because they are Christian. No Christianity there. It is just a name for them. So, mtu wa kenda Lebanon ni kiambia unenda kwa Christian, kwa kia fusana. Lebanon ni kainchi kadongo, lakini kakona mauvu mingi sana. Mingi. 
Uh, Mesh umeishi, umefanya kazi Lebanon for the longest time. Now, let me ask, and I think, yeah. you remember, just a couple of weeks ago, tulikuwa hapa, I brought, I brought the deputy ambassador, Kasim. Kasim, by the way, is the one who's communicating with the family. He's communicating with Dominic. He's, he's communicating with, uh, uh, with Gilbert. I have all the communications. Now, I'm going to ask you one, one question. Do you buy the story yeah. that, do you buy the story of Kwamba, uh, Edna, Alianguka from the third floor? I can't, I can't buy the story because Alan, ana kutoka that floor. Ana mkaji kutoka that floor hivyo unless waseme alikuwa na ushadirisha. But how? I can't buy that story. I can't. Alan, I've sent a link. You can join, you can join me here as a guest. Uh, meanwhile, I'm, uh, we are trying to bring Dominic back to this conversation, and uh, we're gonna have, we're gonna keep running this conversation. And I actually, what I want, what I want, what I want to do is, I would like also to bring the deputy ambassador. I know it's tough. I know it's gonna be tough to have to get Kasim to come back here for the second time. But Kasim, I'm reaching out to you. I'm reaching to the Kenyan consulate. I'm reaching to the Kenyan consulate in Lebanon again. Send a representative to come to Vote TV, and please let us talk about this issue of Edna Kemonto. There is one, there's the, another, another part of the story that it's not, you know, kind of confusing me. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't even know about it. Is the fact that she left the hospital and she, she was taken back to the house. Mm -hmm. You know, Nelson, we have, let, let me explain. We have two case, two types of cases. Eh? We have a girl who was drawn by Madame Kutoka Ju Hadichini. Uyo nasikia, hamezungushwa kutoka kwa hospitali, haka fichwa kwa agent, haka pelekwa kwa boss, hame fichwa kwa, kwa agency, na hapa tika nisa hii. Asa unajua hii ya kemunto ndo nashanga. Is it the same same kemunto mwenye liusha kutoka kwa gorofa? Ju mwenye liusha kwa gorofa, hapa tika ni hadisa hii. Kesi ya kemunto ni mwenye liusha kwa gorofa. Ama... Allow me, give me one second, have another guest. Today na kwambia, leo ni leo. Uh, we are going to, we, are, we, we, we have a lot of folks who are here. Uh, we have a lot of folks here. Again, let me say, um, the two uncles are here. Dominic is here. Gilbert is here. Mesh, who has, worked in, who has actually worked in Lebanon for eight years. And I'm going to bring another guest here, Alan Osemo, to join the show. Alan Osemo, welcome to Vote TV, my brother. How are you doing today? Oh yes, good morning, brothers and sisters. It's uh, uh, tell the viewers where you are watching from, and uh, in, and then a word to the family of Edna Kemonto. Um, I'm watching from Kenya. I'm in uh, I'm in Sia County, a sub county mm. Gunja. I'm a Luabe mm. tribe, and you mm. know uh, this. Uh, it's really touching when you see young ladies going to. Gulf states without without a uh, consent of a uh, family you know the most of us most of our ladies they do hide uh, their problems when they are taking their their risk there so you only want to urge them that whenever you want to do something you can risk it is good to risk it is good to do something good but it is good to have that blessing that blessing will keep you Blessed. There, that's right. And and that's there's something right. here. Our ladies in Gulf they do really forget this thing called prayer. It's only key. It's the only way to overcome these challenges. To to my family, to our family there. Uh, may the God give them strength and uh, courage as we overcome uh, uh, this situation. So. I do like Vote TV because whenever I hear that bell ringing, I just <laughs> I just came in directly because I want to share something mm. here, others. You know, me and my family. My wife is in in Saudi, and wow. I do follow her every day, every moment, every second. I got to go two hours without talking to her. You know, because I know why. Reason is one. People go, others do go there uh, without uh, con maybe any, our, 
hawawelezeta wanaume wanaume wao kwamba wameenda wengine wanajificha unaona but we realize uko na yeye uko na watoto sasa inabidi umfollow hakuna mwanaume anazapenda mke wake au mke Alan 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 bibi yako alikwambia akienda ilikuwa ni struggle alitoka kama si yuko but now i have to i have to be very close to her lazima ni kwe almost to the agency mpaka ile agency ko pale saudi niko very yani niko yani na kwamba niko niko na wazimu hadi dakika hizi ni sababu ni na follow ikiti all the time nikisema ngine na lia na tuchuka wow 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 tena so i have to hata kwanza nienda alinipea nini yako nikutafute ndio nikakufollow nikakufollow huwa na kila mali na kupin everywhere oh really yes our sisters eh wakuwe fan mm. this blessing iko na kitu huwa ina ina protect hiyo ndio message niko nayo and to my brothers nitaenda kisi maybe ina tameka rejim na bashir atanipea namba nitaenda oh. Yes. Eh hey, 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 lazima connect na hii familia connect na familia connect Allah nacho nikwambie and again thank you very much na kuonanga ukiingia uh, na kodi uh, I understand you 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 feel you feel that pain like, like now when you hear the uncle say, when you hear the uncle saying both uncles saying look there was no consent we didn't even know that she left the country we yes. found out in July that she had already gone to Lebanon that's number one. Yes. for me the most painful for me the most painful thing is mm. the fact that she had a diploma in banking and wow. accounting the family had sacrificed take you know they, they you know they took her to college listen kisi university yeah yeah mm. that means she was what intelligent she was smart she was young 22 years old mash vinto we've lost a 22 year old Kenyan who had who could have had a beautiful life yeah. a beautiful career working at a bank somewhere working for a corporate firm somewhere that's the uncles unasikia unasikia the mom aonge unasikia the the grandma has been unconscious for two days because of the shock Yeah. Na nyinyi wanawake kujeni hapa. Kujeni hapa. Kujeni hapa. Let me ask a question. Ni wangapi wana watch ni wangapi wana watch hii show ya leo ambao wako Saudi ama Lebanon ambao walitoka nyumbani bila kuombea mabwana zao bila kuambia wazazi ni wangapi mikono juu i know there's someone here who's watching gilbert aizi ni wa mkono mesh okay let me ask you mesh mesh your opinion yeah. what do you, what do you say to these women who leave the country they don't get the blessings of their husbands they don't get the blessings of their parents and yet they wonder why they are chasing devils and fighting they having spiritual warfare yeah 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 ah uh, listen let me say this i cannot blame them eh wewe wa blame kun nelson kuna a point inafika somebody is so desperate unataka kwenda nje and your family inakata so majority wanaenda kufiri siri si kupenda I know some people are passing very hard situation back here in Kenya. So I can't blame them. But many ngambia mtu in case we unaenda mahali make sure you tell someone wa familia yenu take copies zako za visa passport yako be with them and then ukifika huko pigia mzazi wako mwambie mimi nilienda kwa sababu ya hii na hii. Afadhali umwambie kama ushaenda. You tukiwa blame the same same family you go to them you ask for help but they don't help you. Yeah. So I can't blame them. Mimi nitasema mtu akienda ukifika huko peana details zako kwa wazazi. Nelson si kupenda si kupenda. Like I was in I was okay. in airport okay. Okay. On but, okay. last week on Tuesday. But Yeah.
But let's not sugarcoat though. Strike it. Watcha 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 kumwagilia Royco na watcha kumwagilia um you know mm. some some spices to make this thing look sweet. Kuna watu ambao wanatoka pale kwa sababu wanadanganya na wengine. Agent amekuja hapo amekuchapa Kiswahili. Inadanganya. Kiswahili. Exactly. Na hii TikTok watu wanafikiria tu washafika Hollywood. Eh? My friends. Eh? Uh, uh, Alan, you are here, you are perfect example. How many kids do you have with your wife? Two. You have two. Okay, Mesh. Mesh, what do you say? Yeah. Ah, akwambia, akwambia mzee akienda. Okay, uh alikuwa na shida. The other side of her. I I realize at the last you know, minute. Know, like, we, have, we have to check. Okay. You have to check okay, both sides. Okay. I understand Let's... both sides. No. No. There's something here that it happens in uh, in marriages. You know, today we yeah. judge tomorrow. You never yeah. know what will come next. Yeah. Maybe leo yeah. nzakula mboga but uko free. No na. Si lazima ukule nyama kila siku. But this, our ladies wanafanya hivi. We on a deep secrets because once mta kona hii kitu itwa touch phone na ni kubwa mm. and they engage the groups unaona zimeandikwa Gulf Saudi Arabia and blah 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 unasikia mtu amesema yeah. amejenga nyumba unasikia mtu amenunua mm. kagari unasikia mtu amenunua kaploti mm. na uwezi jenga hiyo ploti yako within two years you mm. see umewest marriage umetoka right. umewest marriage right. umetoka ndio alafu that's right they have secret ile siri iko unalala mwanamke kwa nyumba yako hapo na anafanya hizi mm. vitu chini ya maji wewe mwanaume ushughuliki hizi hizi zinafanyika saa nne agent agent mm. ambe anasikia ule mm. ule mtana yote anamsukuma Nairobi bro ana eh ana broke. broke very fast sa so, mm. end up this marriage is not working hiyo ni kitu ya kwanza kuna that's right ameku, ame, amekuficha siri uwezi jua akili zake yeah secondly that's right. ndio ndio usimfuatilie anafanya hizi process pole pole Mm. Dai kama mwisho unakutana naye na ujua the problem. By the time unachukua time yako ku cool down, you realize where the mistake is, you fix the yeah. problem with the family, una end up yeah. nobody is there. Alan, I completely agree with you and I comp- I completely understand your situation. Bonake bon- Njeri yeah. ambaye amekufia Saudi, Bonake Njeri mm. alikuwa anaenda skiza. Pia mm-hmm. mesh kuja hapa. Bonake Njeri alikuwa anaenda kumlilia kwa shule don't go while she was at the training school wow really skiza familia gilbert uko hapa and you guys i want kwa sababu eh hey, kina gilbert maze wacha watu wacha kwa nijiweke nguvu mimi ukiona mwanaume akilia that kills that shatters my soul but skiza familia akasema you know what kama unisikizi mimi nikiwa bwanako familia ikaita pasta listen to this it's been documented right here right here on Vo TV Gilbert wakaita pasta ende wangia nao msichana acha tafadhali asende Saudi mm-hmm. kaa tu hapa yes tujenge maisha kaa tu hapa mungu mungu atafungua mesh what do you, what do you say about that ume usikiza umekataa kusikiza bwana umekataa ku uh, umekataa ume, ume kusikiza pasta utasikiza nani mwingine hiyo ni ignorance and now here we are here we are kama vile ana nimesema first of all the marriage is broken number two, the kids now have been left with, with no mother number n- number three, biashara ya bwanake ambayo ilikuwa Nairobi ilisimama it hasn't worked for three months yes. and now here comes the top the top cream de la cream financially completely ruined tuanze harambe tuanze nini tuanze nini is it worth it no. lena welcome here Thank you. Good morning everybody. Good morning. Len, 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 Len. Talk to people. 
Let them know. Let them know. Listen, you know, listen. We know that we we can flip this accent real fast. Tell tell, tell them where you're watching from. Welcome, Lena. Such a sad morning. Yeah, I'm watching from New Jersey. Welcome. And um, this is my family friend. It's really really sad. He's telling me, "Ata si juu ni melia, si juu ni seme ni juu ni mtoto mdogo ame tuacha." I don't know what to say. I, I really ame wow. Sababu wa kwa mbona? Ali tubu ali wow. Oh, arabu ni mbaya sana. I don't know what to say. Mimi mmoja tulikuwa naongea leza hata huko 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 mbele. Mwezo ni mtoto wa sistangu na mimi ndiye mmemsomesa from from PP class mpaka university. Na akaenda huko sasa kutafuta tumkona sana unajua si vizuri kuonyesha hapa 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 inaanza mtu I think Dominic is having a conversation with someone huko. Okay let me mute let me mute uh microphone za Dominic Konza. Okay Lena Uh, Gilbert na Dominic wameongea about uh, now we know exactly what has happened na vile kumeendelea how do you feel as a, as a family friend na unajua umsichana Penye mimi kwangu vile nafikiria uh, kulingana hata na hiyo ripoti wameandika hakuna ukweli kwapo There is something behind that report and kuna mtu anajua either even a husband kuna kitu ana kuna kitu hataki kusema i'm sorry to say mm. kuna kitu iko mahali imepichwa na hawataki kusema familia ya sendi yake na bwana i don't know but mimi kulingana na nini yangu kuna vile naona kuna kitu hawataki kusema kwa sababu sidhani yo msichana i don't know vile wanasema alitoka hospitali akaenda kwa nyumba But it drew kulingana na ile condition alikuwa I don't think alitoka kwa hiyo kitanda I don't know That's right Naongea kulingana na vile nafikiria but I don't know but kulingana na vile anaonekana I don't think aliamka akaenda alitoka kwa hiyo kitanda akaenda nyumbani Sidhani alitoka hospitali Na hakuna venye unaweza Angu kuna vile mimi nafanya hospitali hakuna venye unaweza anguka kuna vile mtu akianguka unaelewa huyu ni kuanguka alianguka but hakuna venye unaweza anguka no hiyo hiyo no 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 somebody we need we need the truth somebody need to tell what happened that's right and na vile najua kulingana na vile najua i love kenya is my country But just right. in Kenya is very expensive not about money That's right When I talk about expensive I'm not talking about money I'm talking nope. about like mtu kama tuseme mtu kama wa kawaida akikufa wana wanachukulia tu kuna cases mingi sana ziko pending hata ukipeleka hii waeleze wanaona tu hiyo ni it's like nothing to them That's right Naona. So That's right. Si, na kitu kingine najua Lebanon na inanga embassy ya Kenya. Sijui kama wasikana right. wanaelewa hivyo. There is no embassy embassy in Lebanon. There is no Kenya embassy in Lebanon. I don't know because sijawahi kwa hizo incident. Na siku anatarajia. Naona anga hizi case every day kuzi na kufuatilia. Nafuatilia nini? kwa YouTube siku anafikiria nitakuja kuongelea mtu mwenye nina ako karibu na mimi unajua siku That's moja right. siku anafikiria kuzi mimi hata mtu akiniambia anaenda huko siwezi ongea na yeye hamsoli kuna wenye wanaenda huko wana make but mimi iwe ni Saudi Arabia iwe, I'm sorry kama kuna mtu nitakuwa iwe ni Saudi Arabia iwe ni wapi kulingana na zile kesi nimeona hata sinanisumbuanga sina akili sometimes kama kuna hiyo nini uli aya yesterday damari damari osita i can sleep that thing is stuck in my mind all the time i can sleep uh, that huyo uh, mtu alipitia uchungu gani mm. it is really painful 
na, na Kenya government they don't want to do anything na kwa sababu wa, mimi ile kitu nasema si semi wale watu wako sadarivyo wako mali pabaya ama uko Lebanon but wangoje kwanza kama kuna mtu anataka kwenda saa hizi angoje kwanza mpaka serikali ikuwe clear kama ni agent iwe ni serikali na iko like wanaeleweka venye wanaenda kama mtu amegonjeka kuna vile mtamfuatilia kuna vile like kitu iko straight that's right kama vile sasa tuko hapa US mimi nikigonjeka napigia familia na wanakuja haitakuwa na problem the same thing why kama why kwa nini hata huko nchi zingine sikae the same you know yeah. the thing is Lena I've been yeah Alan continue yeah. Alan continue I want to I want to give uh, my sister Lena an information here about these travel agencies when wakishajua kuna pesa inatiririka tamu sana inaingia Kenya kuna kuna wale hawataki hizo vitu zifanyike hata through airport na kwari unajua vizuri nao badala wa badala 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 toke na huko wanakuita hapa kwa barabara hapa through Uganda Sudan that's right hawa ndio wana travel that's right you right hapo hapo sasa ndio mwanzo wa problem ukiwa kwa ndege ni vizuri unaona tu uko heaven once you right. land ile upepo na kupiga tu hivi that's right unaanza kuwa na shida umeanza kuwa slave na ule upepo vile unapumua tayari so my sister ukiongea kuhusu agencies na traveling bla 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 our ladies wanapenyeshwa tu hapa tu na wanafita hapa na wenyewe they know they do them then he mistake on afanya ni mao so we can't blame that is the problem. i'm sorry to cut you off but that is the problem kitu yoyote mm. unaona inakuja kwa ulaisi inaisa kwa ulaisi right. ni vizuri inatake right. time ukiona That's kitu umechukua right. muda ukiona kitu inafanywa haraka haraka nasikia wanaambiwa ati within one month the passport imetokea na wameenda unaona mm. So na kitu kingine mm. mtu ukienda ambia watu wenu umehenda. Wacha mkae mm. si familia, waeleze, right. waambie I'm traveling. Waambie vile right. unataka kufanya hata kama watakataa, make sure umewaelezea. Kaa chini na wao mm. waambie mimi nimeona wacha nifanye ABCD. Na mm. hivi ndio plan yangu, hivi ndio unataka kufanya. But mm. ukienda utoloke kwa sababu unajua hata hawa maenje tu wanajuanga huyu ajaenda na familia familia hawa That's right. The, That's wana, right. Kwa ukisaelewa kuna kitu sasa kama familia yako haina habari wanaweza mm. kusema lolote kuzi kuna mki, kuna mtu mwingine niliona kuna kesi nyingine niliona last week but one Huyo mama alikuwa anasema waliwa bwanake na wakatoa hogan Walikuwa na, familia inapigania kwa sababu waliwaambia wanataka kuusa Yes, Edward yes. got. So walikuwa hapa Lena. They were here. All this they, you know they all come to vote TV. Walikuwa hapa. Alan and people ever they were here. Bwana Tatusa. The same case na Edward mm-hmm. anafikiria hata hii maybe hata mwanake kuna pesa anapewa. Ana that's why I don't know. I'm I'm just saying. No, 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 listen, say, listen. Lena, it's the same mm-hmm. thing that I say too. It's the same thing that I say because mm-hmm. they would then make you they, they would then what they, what they do is Remember there's a there's a document that they sign that in the event mm. in the event the person passes away you 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 give your own content for the for for your organs to be donated now yes yes hata hapa unajua si unajua tukienda kwa motor vehicle na ulisango ukiendea driving license wanakuuliza just in case upatane na accident do you want to donate your organs ukisema yes na wako kwa you are driving lessons hivyo ndio watu wanafanya hapa US so sasa sijui huko wanafanya aje maybe hata huko wanafanya the same just in case so Lena they do that but now the thing is and uh case ya Edward Gadongo is the perfect example wakati familia I'm talking and remember Gadongo has has a wife and two kids 
But the first next of kin was the mother for contract. What? Not the wife. Which Why is the funniest the thing ever. Why not the wife? I repeat. I repeat. So, you um, know, once well, when once yeah. they are filling out those documents, they don't they're not even saying they they can put out any anyway. It, it in, uh, I'm hundred percent I'm I'm hundred percent sure there's a there's a there's a figure they mentioned because they even booked a fake lawyer. The mother and the in-laws now are trying to dis disinherit the Dongo's wife and the kids. Yeah. 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 See where I'm coming from? The craziest story mm -hmm. ever. And by the way, they are coming back. I'll be bringing them back on Vote TV. Because now mm -hmm. Alan in the court case. Okay. Apa kwa Bonake and Dominic, I'll bring you back. Bonake uh, Bonake uh, Edna. Mm. There is something here. Kuna kitu wa pambatu ambacho watu awaongei. Kuna kitu wa naongea bihaki nyume ya tena. Kuna kitu huyu mstana kwa hapa misema. Na mina ona ni ukweli. Uwenda ikawa huyu ni the same lady mwana anasemekana alitupa kwa gorofa. Ina, meembi ni yeyo. Mimi kulinda na na vigo. Inaeza kuwa ni yeye. Ita confirm. Ita confirm. Leo ni kawambia. Na kitu ingine familia. Ba, kama yes. familia wana muwasa. Wanaitaji usailisi. Vile mwili tapika Kenya. Mwenye anajua vizuri sana. Vile like. Kama kuna mtu anajua venye anaeza wanini. Kuzi sasa nao ile kitu wanaitaji mubadi. Tuwa kuna kitu ingine. Hmm. That's Mm -hmm. So ita inakuwa hard. But at, okay, oh, I don't know. Um le, le, uh, Lena, Lena. Hey, America, Middle East these are two different worlds. So I know. It's like, I know but this is listen, weird. Listen. And you are Kenyan. Hey. Your sister, your brother <laughs> drying and you can't do nothing. There is nothing you can do. This is really sand. I hate the Kenyan government. I'm saying that. I don't care who is watching. But me, for myself, I will never even vote because they don't care about our to my skin, our wajari. I don't care. I don't care. But please, please, government need to do something. What's an hour to a twist? What to protest every single day? To not protest a war to. Watoto wa ndogo kila siku wanaenda kujitafutia kwa sababu Kenya hata kama umesoma hakuna kazi wazee wamekalia kutoka miaka nenda miaka rudi wamekaa hapo watoto wamemaliza ma university na edangafu kufanya kazi hmm? kama Edna kama wajasuna. Edna wamesoma but hakuna kama kani kwa office wala wako kwa office hata hata ukiuliza mtu hata kuandika yenye wajui wengine naona hata wakiwajua kwa hata kuongea kizuri kuna basi kuna mtu fulani amesoma kabisa na ana kazi kwa sababu gani kuna mtu anamjua kwa ofisi hakuna mtu anamjua akienda huko lazima uitiswe maybe 1 million umekosa chakula ya kukula sasa unaenda kwa ofisi kuitiswa 1 million utatoa wapi kazi unaenda huko ngarafu sio kupenda kwa hmm? Wow, really sad. Kakware. Uh, how uh, just Kakware, sema Kakware. Ebu as sa zile tunafuatilia hii history ya Edna. Because mm. unje tumekuuliza tumekuuliza pale uzumi yo clip u, u screenshot. Nilikuwa naona I, I could be able to tell I alikuwa very weak on one side. Vile alikuwa ame ame That, That's right. Yeah, that was a good observation. Yes. Eh, eh. Now. That's right. How 
kama mune, kama mumekuwa na clue kwamba kuna kuaga na eh, mtu akionekana hajiwezi wanatoa hizo organs do you think yeah. there is a possibility of something such it has happened kwa kuwa wameona iko unconscious so now they talk to the husband tunaweza kuaje na hiyo clue kwamba husband kama hataki kuongea <coughs> tuko na clue gani vile tunakuwa tumekuwa suspicious I mean I mean my sister in 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 New Jersey can you can you comment on that actually the, actually the, the uncle is here let's we're going to start with the uncle uh, and by the way let yeah. me say let me, I'm I'm a thank I'm a thank Lena Lena is the one who who brought the story of Edna to my attention wow and then everything else connected from there mm-hmm. um Dominic this conversation the way in Andalia uh, through the through the palace with the husband uh, do you agree there are some things that uh, they are hiding uh, there is suspicion there is suspicion because i tried to request them to give me the number of the boss but they are not ready to give up to now I tried to ask the same agents to give me the number of the boss. They referred me back to the husband. Because he's the next of kin. The, 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 the agent uh, was too rude to me. Wow. So me, I just told them I wanted to number so that they can know exactly what's happening. I went back to the husband. I told him, can you just give me the number of the boss? The husband told me the the boss is diabetic and he doesn't want the disturbance. He said What? again that he, he told me the, the the boss is diabetic. He doesn't want he doesn't need stress. There is something wrong somewhere. So from there I I I requested him to talk to the boss. He replied, he told me all the time we communicate to the boss. The boss gives the agent the information. From that, the agent gives the husband the, the information. But the suspicion went ahead when he said, when he, he was trying to communicate with my niece, and unfortunately, the, the call never went all, through, he can text the boss and the boss will text back and tell him oh we didn't wifi oh we have not paid we will pay so i don't understand why now the boss can reply when they talk on just but now when the patient is in hospital he cannot reply direct three <clears throat> Uh I tried to ask you when did Edna went to Lebanon? Yes. Uh from the uh, from the husband is giving contradicting information. He's saying June. There you go. But in the reality it's like they went to it Jan, December January because he, uh, I've done a lot of investigation. I'm a man who works with the security guard as a private security. <laughs> I'm taught on investigation. I've gone for as far as searching for the conversation he did not had with friends. They have a group of January, Lebanon, January single, I don't understand. So it's like he did not went to Lebanon either late December or January. Wow. I have a conversation between the <coughs> husband and the the uh, i think they said they are the consulate the representative of kenya in lebanon yeah when they tried to to, to ask if they were in communication with edna regularly was it not sending it money so from there if you want me to send the same the same voice calls i can send you i got the voice calls you from can... the from from the consulate um representative i know him mr kasim uh, sorry his name is mr kasim i have the voice notes you have them yeah 
Yeah, I sent it, I shared with my brother Gribbard because I got it direct yeah. from the consulate. Yeah. So the husband agreed and he was just just fine that he doesn't have any complaint, he doesn't blame anybody. And yet he has not even asked you how can somebody fell from the, the third floor? Huh? He's just uh, uh, acknowledging that they, they, are, they were in good terms. How does, does, does he know? Two, and when he did not told... When he did not told... When he did not told the husband that... He, let me just uh, resume working so that the Madam Reddy, when he comes, he don't complain. Hmm. Third statement shows that the Madam Reddy was a very, very, very bad person. What if the, the, the Madam Reddy arrived immediately and they found it has done nothing? And the convict started there. And you say hey, you don't blame anybody. It's crazy. From observing all those scenarios, actually, it's only that I'm, I'm very, very disturbed. Even the consulate, they were not ready. I asked them, why can't you tell me if the Edna is, is dead or not dead? They told me, no, Edna is in a coma. In reality, Edna died on 25th. And I've been communicating from 26, 7, 8, 9, up to the second when, it, when it, I, I, put, I, I put pressure to them. Then they, 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 they say that it's close the same. So both the consulate plus the agents plus the, the husband, they are very bad people. Though I have nothing to, to say because from the conversation, I have every conversation between me and the consulate. I have a conversation between me and the agent. I have all a conversation between me and the husband. When I go through the conversation, I suspect there's something wrong. And from the that medical report says they removed spleen. Why? It says this in the word report. Spleen. That's right. This, this word spleen. Can can you explain to me mm. what is it? What, what it's an was organ. It's an organ in the, in the huh. body. You know they sell the organs over there. They sell the organs. Yeah. They say even the husband, maybe yeah. they spoke to husband. I don't know. I'm sorry, I don't know. I'm sorry to cut you off. But I think they spoke to a husband. That's why husband you don't want to say the truth. She's not she's not going to make it. Uto chukua i pesa to chukwe organs. Aka kubari. And that's why I take it to ukweli. Yes. Nimeulisa consulate. Is there any conversation now? Because he died while on duty. Uh, mm. The people I was, the boss has spent more than $20,000 in medication. So, si lasima aripe, lakini akiona anesaripa, nona, akiona. And this somebody, mwenye wanasema alianguka, why anafanya kazi? Kwa ni hakuna insurance kwa hiyo agent? TV in Lebanon, Lebanon Lebanon. So for me, I think ni pua, 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 very poor. vizuri. But kosabapo kwa organs, Lebanon they are very strict. Madaktari wangu hawapindangi kucheza na maisha ya wafanyikazi. But kutritiwa, mkose dawa, hiyo ndo ineza kwa kimo. But suna siya organs, olindi organs zimetolewa. Olindi zimetolewa. Kwa report, umesoma hiyo report? Umesoma hiyo report? Olindi organs zimetolewa. Umesoma hiyo report? The report in Mesh. the way come back a lapa stamp. Mesh, so we, have a, we have a for, can you share? We have a forensic. Yeah, I can share it. We have a forensic. We have we have a forensic report from, uh, yeah. from the doctor. Mm. Forensic. Now, I'm going to make a video. Kwa yo video, kuna uyo mwenyari murete a rosary. Mm. Mm. 
na hiyo video ikachukuliwa right. context mm. na ikakuwa shared kukuja Ken na wanamwambia waambie unakuja very smart can I, can, I, can I play that video again but it's very emotional yeah, yeah. yeah sure but i'm going to play but then let me let me see that video where she is saying kuja, kuja, kuja. tell your family I'm, you are coming home yeah Uh, let's watch this video together folks give me a second <clears throat> uh, and you have my gift for you this is jesus who protected you because you are a good person okay say hi to your family in kenya tell them that you are coming okay they love you too okay my dear god bless you What? Give, give me water. Water, yeah. Okay, I will give you water. Let me play this. Let me let me play this video one one more time, and let's listen to exactly what she, what the lady is talking about. You're coming to Kenya. Uh, let, it's like this was like a fair. This 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 is like a farewell message. And you have my gift for you. This is Jesus who protected you because you are a good person. Okay? Say hi to your family in Kenya. Tell them that you okay. are coming. Okay. Okay. Can I can I pause there? Yeah. Let me let me let me bring back my 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 guests. Do you realize she's talking in terms of past tense? This is This is Jesus who protected you because you are a nice person. Yes, you are a good person. This good is prayer, Jesus Paula. who protect you. Yes. See I'm coming from? Yes. The viewers? Another question mark. The same thank you very much. When I played that video, I kept on rewinding that part. The rosary Jesus who protected you when while you are alive but now because you're on, you are on your way out mm -hmm. your family you you're going home See how I'm coming from And then And at the end of that we say for water Right. Really want to speak for what? So bad. That right there. All right. The, you put together all those elements. Lena, Dominic, Gilbert, Kakware, Mesh. You put all those elements together. And there you have the mm -hmm. answer. No, mimi kuna kitu moja nilikuwa naona. Mimi mimi kuna kitu moja nataka kuuliza. Do you hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. Loud and okay. clear. Kuna mimi na kumuuliza. You know mimi nimefika hapo kwa Pascal. Ikitoka juu ikuja kwa on the Macho. side of the high eye. You know mtu akiwa ameanguka from the top. Third it's almost That's like uh, it's like uh, 60 feet. Mimi ni mjenzi. It's like 60 feet. Toka juu. Ukianguka chini na upige hiki kitu hapa. I tell you uwezi kaa even three days kama hujapasudiwa hapa lazima kuna kwa kuna bondage it is kuna bondage inyuele imetolewa na kuna kuna some internal bleed bleed ile ilikuwa ndani maybe waweza kuwa wamevuta wametoa hiyo so kwa nini akufanywa hiyo good question nothing number one hello hello my brother wamesema wali wamesema wamemfanyia wamesema wame wamefanyia surgery ya, ya kichwa hakuna in the report hakuna surgery kwa report angalia report yeah no, it says that the forensic report hakuna report, report. sasa nataka kutumia akili lakini ukiangalia vizuri on the, uh, kwa side mahali amenyolewa kuna mahali ameshonwa hapa hakuna scar 
Eko nayo. Kuna mahali ukiangalia hizo picha nimetuma ukisumu vizuri kuna mahali inaonekana kama amekatwa lakini not sio hiyo side mahali macho imeume. Tu huyu mtu alianguka ako na multiple fractures mikono yes. ikafunjika lakini ikafunjika hapa eh Mhm Aliangukia mikono mikono ile ingefunjika ingefunjika kwa kwa hii Mtu ameanguka ameangukia kichwa ameangukia mikono imefunjika miguu iko na shida intestine iko na shida liver iko na shida spleen iko na shida Cerebro hemorrhage inamaanisha kulikuwa na breathing Masha. kwa upongo. Brain damage. Those, those, those yes. are two main things. Two main things. But, kulingana mimi na akili yangu, kulingana vile yeah. naona, naona ni kama alipigwa. Sio kuanguka. Yeah, ali, walimuumiza kichwa, wakaumiza yeah. mikono. Eh? Mikono imevunjika this side. Kuzake acho kiangalia mikono imefungwa. Angwangiliwa maji. Maji moto. Hebu angalia angalia tena hiyo mikono ukisubu mikono angalia kama kutakuwa na process. Ona vidore vile zina move. Hizo vidore. Ya yeah, paralyzed. Paralyzed. But hakuna mali amenyolewa nywele hapo. Angalia Chaki. kuna picha waja video waja video kuna picha nilitumia hapo hizo za nyamerara Okay dear They love you too Okay my dear God bless you Okay and, and that, that, saying, that, that, I'm coming I'm coming as if she was traveling the same day That's right That's right the, those those the choice of words they they picked for this video Mm. Was a fa- this was this was this was a farewell message. Mm-hmm. Uh Dominic, we had that conversation before. Yes. Right here, the, the, the eye, this this black patch uh, on apple. the right eye. Kwenda nyuma sasa kwenda kwenyewe. Utaona kama kuna kitu kama imeshonwa stitches. Do you mean coming down from the from the neck? Yeah. This one apple here. Apple kasa hapo hapo okay got it okay uh what was your suspicion about this lena when you saw this when you, um, this you being a nurse can you bring in your expertise here hiyo inakaa kama ali ali mwagiri hiyo ni kama maji hiyo sio kuanguka kulingana na experience hiyo sio kuanguka na ndio na na yeah hiyo sio kuanguka. They need to yeah, tell us the truth. And because she is gone, she is not coming back. But we need to know the truth what, what but nobody is able to tell us the truth. You know? We'll do the Dominic and Gilbert and the family mtafanya postmortem once once she arrives, right? Yeah, yeah we will. Mm-hmm. We must. I have a question here. What? What? I have a question. Water, yeah. Okay, I will give you water. Okay, let's look at the hand. There's something there was a statement you were making about the hand uh Dominic. Angalia mkono walisema iko na fracture na anapeleka mkono anachipangusa na vidole. That's right. Yeah, but kulingana na vile hizo vidole vile zimekaa zina nguvu. Si ndio inamaanisha hii mkono imefunjika mfupa. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Na itakuwa managed kwa sababu mimi nimewahi pata accident mkono ninajua vile mkono inakuwa. Hiyo mkono inatakikana ifungwe kuanzia kwa bidole ndio bidole sika straight. Mbona 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 hakuna plaster? Ndio hizo zilikuwa zinatakikana ziweko plaster mpaka juu. Gugengua na prasta. Hiyo mkono wangesema iko na fracture, gugengua na prasta. Lakini iko bandage. Na maanisa kuna someone who's staying. Exactly. Huh? That's exactly. Look yeah. at the, look at the comment. Look at the comment now we are analyzing this video at the same time. Even one of my uh, uh, followers here in Nafatiti, thank you very much. And uh, look she is saying look at the bandaged arm 
it's like it's burnt, of which I agree. Hiyo bandage ya mtu akiwa amechomeka na maji. Amechomeka. Yeah. Anga, angalia hiyo bandage mahali bandage imeisha kuna yeah. kitu kama process. Kama kidonda kucha ichafunikwa. Wow. Yeah, I can see. Tumevua dhile hizo video sio ati yani usione nalia nalia kwa sababu ni nini? Yale huyo mtoto alipitia. And you have my gift for you. This is Jesus who protected you because you are a good person. Okay? <laughs> she, if exactly come Connor, if if the hand is fractured, she can still lift the arm. Yeah. Guys. Do people yeah. know these days that we do people know these days that we, that people on the on on YouTube and the internet they solve crimes like this on behalf of the police? This is Jesus no. who protected you because you are no, the no, no, okay. okay. I know what they I know what they were saying. I know what they were saying. I know what they were saying. I know what they October. Mm. Huh? Almost two months. Wow. Let me bring back the panel. Guys. I have a question. I have a question here. Mi kuna mahali bado nimekuamilia. Na I'm trying to figure out hiyo urefu toka juu kama wanasema ametoka ameanguka kutoka kwa nyumba kupata chini. It's a big no. Kwa sababu ukiangalia hiyo mkono amevunjikia ni mkono mwingine na amekuwa paralyzed on the other hiyo side nyingine side ya kichwa hiyo alianguka mm. sideways kama wanasema ile kutoka juu which is a big lie kuanguka it's a big no angetangulisha kichwa kichwa ingeingia kwa shingo ingeingia na shingo ndani na ikuja na side haingekuja kwa ile mkono mwingine pande ule mwingine yes Angeangukia mikono mikono ingefunjika yote hapa kwa pega. That's Apo right. Na ingefunjika miguu pia. Miguu pia walimba agona 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 fractures. Ambapo we have another My friend hiyo nyumba hiyo hmm. nyumba kutoka pale juu nyumba nyumba fat slab it is almost uh, like uh, 13 th like 15 feet. Uongeze hiyo ingine It's like 45 or 50 feet. Toka juu. I am very sure. Your length you cannot. But watu wengi watu watu wengi waanguka wakuwa affected kwa mgongo. Spine wangekuwa affected. Hiyo ni kitu kuna kuna mahali wamesema hakuna mahali wamesema spine iko na shida. Kuna kitu kwa binadamu. Kuna kitu kwa binadamu hapa hivi kakware. Ukienda kuanguka chini unaona unaona kuanguka chini na unaona unaenda una, 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 twist kuna vile wewe yeah will fall na ile part ulikuja nayo but utaanguka na ile yes. part na believe hautakuwa nayo na pain utakuwa sio there's a big question okay let's do, uh, let's do like this folks uh, uh, lena new jersey dominic nairobi gilbert kisi alan tia yes mess I don't know I don't know where you are I don't know whether you are you are in Mexico or Venezuela I don't I don't know where you are right now but thank you very much for tuning in thank you for uh watching the Rockana Vote TV breakfast show what we're going to do is Lena we will do a part two of this story there's too much to catch up here all I'm going to say and to all the viewers it's a sad day for humanity we've lost a 22 year old who had a diploma in banking and accounting i wish you a beautiful sunday evening a sunday for us here i got to go i got to end because i, I, I got 3 seconds on i want to say something but i see the viewers are asking how they can communicate with the family maybe you want to link the uh, one of the brat, one of the hanko's number cuz uh, yeah one send of send everything but they can i got to go i got to cut it it's clicking One, two, because my system is programmed. Sorry, sorry Lena. 
it's technology. Um, it's send, send a message to Vote TV WhatsApp and then we'll take it from there. Okay.